understand your back. This is your spine. First of all, there is the cervical spine. This takes the weight of your head and allows a lot of movement, such as when you're looking up to the sky or looking down or turning your neck like when you're driving in the car. Next, there is the thoracic spine. Here, your ribs are attached to form your rib cage, which help to protect your heart and lungs. Overall, the thoracic spine is really quite rigid and does not allow a lot of movement. And finally, there is the lumbar spine. The lumbar spine have large vertebra, which helps to take the weight of your upper body and also transmits forces up from your legs into your pelvis. There are two main movements of the lumbar spine. There is flexion, which is if when you're bending forward, touching your toes or putting your shoes and socks on, this is flexion, and extension, which is leaning or arching backwards.